Welcome back to The Grind. The new arena system has arrived and in this video, we are going to talk about my opinions as a Thronebreaker free to play player who does like to spend a little bit of time in the arena each week to get some units to help fund content and deals because I don't spend money on the game. So I have to get my units from grinding. Now, what we see is the three verse three, four star or summoner trials here, which is for the three and four stars all up to four stars. Um, and then you have the two arenas where you can get six star champions. Now, I was really worried about the layout of this because if they made it reasonable for players with only five star rosters or limited rosters, that means that players who have a full six star roster with tons of rank twos would pick up tons of units very easily. And we all know that Kabam doesn't want it to be too easy. And so let's take a look at what this is. So all the milestones now in this four star arena only give seven units, whereas in the old version, you could get 15 units for hitting each milestone after. Now, yes, the gap between these is a little bit smaller. It's only 100,000 points for those ones, and then it gets a little bigger, 125,000 points, and then it goes up to a max of uh, 2,150,000. And we're gonna take a look at the breakdown of the rounds it will take to get how many units um, with that shortly and compare it to the old one. But here's the six star arena. So the milestones are giving only 10 units and the gap gets pretty wide. All of a sudden after 3 million points, you're getting uh, a 1 million spread. And to do a 1 million spread with five star champions, especially rank four or five star champions, to grind that out for 10 units is quite a big gap. Whereas in the old five star, or sorry, four star featured arena where you're using your five star champions, you only had to clear a gap of 500,000 points, which you could then get 15 units for. So the amount of units you can earn is very different. And then the points spread even further to 1.5 million and the milestones go all the way up to 16.5 million to complete the six star arenas. And you get 20 units at the very end for the last several prizes there. But let's compare these arenas. So I did some grinding in the last arena before it switched and I wanted to see what a a, in my opinion a solid grind would award me and compare it to the new arena now I didn't go all out but I did a little bit more than what I would typically do on average except I focused more time into the six star arena so I could see how far I could get so all I really did in the three star arena was just to grab a few with some boosts but we're gonna mostly in this video focus on the arenas where I would use my four star champions five star champions and six star champions so typically I don't go past three million in the six star arena and I focus more time and effort into the four star arena than I did this time as well as into the five star arena and we're gonna see why and it actually is quite shocking now it doesn't take long in this four star arena to start earning 15 units per milestone and it only takes 150,000 points for several of these milestones and then eventually it gets a little bit wider after 1 million where it goes to 250,000 points. Now with my four stars, I get 30,000 points per round of my four stars. So up to a million, it's five rounds to get 15 units. And then after that, it's about seven to eight. Now in this arena, I use my five star champions and and once you get going, it's uh, less than 500,000 uh, points at first. And then once you get going, it's 500,000 points for 15 units. And again, it really only takes five rounds to clear the 500,000 uh, points, which gets you 15 units. So the reason I focus more on the four and five star arena is because when you look at the six star arena, it pretty quickly scales up to a million and then 1.5 million points to get the next milestone, which is still only 15 units. And that takes more rounds to do than it does in the other arenas. So let's break it down and do some math. Each round takes about one and a half minutes to complete on average. Some rounds are one minute, some rounds are two minutes, but usually it's more around one and a half minutes. So about seven to nine minutes per five rounds. So with the four star arena doing 29 rounds is what I did. I almost got to the 1 million milestone, uh, which would have been closer to 30 or 31 rounds. But with the 26 rounds I did, it took about 40 minutes and got me 90 units. So 2.25 units per minute. So that's a pretty good return for my time. Where 
Whereas the five star arena, I did 35 rounds, which took about 55 minutes, and I got 105 units, which is just shy of two units per minute at 1.9 units per minute. Now the six star arena was 34 rounds, about 53 minutes, and I only got 75 units. Now, I also tend to think that in the six star arena, because most of my champions are rank one, I end up having the average five round duration last a little bit longer or get closer to that two minutes and maybe sometimes more than two minutes per round of th of uh, three champions and so I feel like it actually ends up taking a little bit longer but these are all just estimates to try to keep everything as even as possible but that ended up getting me 75 units which is 1.4 units per minute which is much less than the others whereas if i'm only doing the four stars and five stars in those other arenas i'm going to average more than two units per minute which is uh, better than the six star arena but now unfortunately even using my five star champions i have to do that in a six star arena where the milestones are much further spread apart so so far i put about 30 rounds in and it got me 45 units now if we round up a little bit more and grab the remainder of that next milestone that That'll be 55 units which is a little bit better but still for the time invested i used to get 75 units but now i'm getting 55 units so as i usually do i went to time how much it would take to get from the next well from one milestone to another and so i went from 4 million to 5 million points to see how many rounds it would take and it took about six rounds and to get that million points that was uh sorry this this picture is uh, before I finished that round, but that's what it took. And then to get to the next milestone is already over a million points, 1.25 million. And that took seven and it would take about seven to eight rounds or so, depending how many five stars you're using. And if you're only using rank one, six star champions. So now what we've done so far, we've gotten 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75 units for six million and what we did was 47 rounds which is extremely depressing because majority of my six star champions are rank one and therefore it actually takes longer to run through a group of three and the average time that it takes to complete one of the rounds is about two minutes which is above the average when i was running in the previous arenas because i was using the top champions for each arena and that means i've invested about 90 minutes into this arena for 75 units Units. That makes my average uh, units per minute less than one, which is horrendous when I was previously averaging about two units per minute with the old arenas. And if I want to grind out to the next milestone, it's going to take me about seven rounds to get there. And soon it's going to be an even wider gap. And that means it's going to take me 15 to 20 minutes to get each milestone. And I'm only going to be getting 15 units. So that puts my unit per time again at about one one unit per minute which is half of what it used to be and they said they were consolidating the units into less arenas and you're going to get more units but they didn't consolidate anything they stretched it out so now not only do you have to have more of the six star champions your five star champions are useless and in order to get the more units that they talked about you have to grind past what you would have had to grind before in order to get all the milestones and so it's just stretched out and prolonged and putting more stress on a limited star rarity which just so happens to be the rarest and hardest to get and it's not easy for players to build up their six star roster so let's say i just want to use the most efficient champs for an arena i'm definitely not going to be able to get as high a score but I want to be as efficient as possible for my unit gain and not waste time for less in return. So I decided to take my averages with my top champions in each arena and see what it would get me if I extrapolated that over certain milestones in a realistic manner. So for Summoner's Trials using the four stars, if I wanted to complete that full arena for the 140 units that it would give me, I would need 2.15 million points, which would take about 40 or sorry, 70 rounds with my top four star champions. And I don't usually put up that much with my four stars. And that would only get me 1.3 units per minute in comparison to the 
over two units per minute that it used to give with the old four star arena now looking at these six star arenas if i did a reasonable grind and put up three million in each arena which i could likely do with my six star roster but that would be a stretch because usually i only run my top six stars um, for the time efficiency and get about three million sometimes 4.5 million points with the old arena model but if i was able to get to three million in both arenas then i would be having to do about 35 rounds and get 40 units from from each of them which would be 90 units but for the time invested would only be 1.6 units per minute which is still well below what it used to be and i won't be able to maximize my number of units because i'll be limited by my smaller roster so basically, those who put in a certain amount of time and effort into the arena are now going to be stuck with much less units, and if they want to get the same amount of units, they'll have to put in way more effort for what they are getting in return than they used to. So I just wanted to break this down a little bit to see how bad it really was, and it is worse than I was hoping it would be, uh, worse than I expected it to be. But I guess that means Arena will be less of a priority for me unless things change. So let me know what you think of the numbers here, if you think that your roster will handle it differently. Uh, but I do hope that they find a solution to make things better for everyone, because right now it is worse for everyone. Thanks for watching. Good luck, and I'll see you in the next video.